Does your next experiment involve IL-18? This video is for scientists who want to run Western blot, IHC, flow or other immunoassays against IL-18. We will cover some basic facts, protein expression, and IL-18's expected behavior in Western blot. All information in this video is based on public information, and no proprietary experimental evidence was used. Topic 1. Quick Facts About IL-18 Interleukin-18 is a member of the IL-1 superfamily that is primarily involved in the regulation of T-helper-1 cells and natural killer cells' immune responses. While most cytokines contain the signal peptide for extracellular release, the IL-18 gene lacks the signal peptide just like other IL-1 family members. IL-18 synergizes with IL-12 to induce the production of various pro-inflammatory cytokines and chemokines, especially IFN gamma. High levels of IL-18 are detected in patients with severe inflammatory disorders and potentially fatal reactions characterized by a cytokine storm. The precursor of interleukin-18 is 193 amino acids long and runs about 24 kilodaltons on western blot while the mature form is 157 amino acids long and runs about 18 kilodaltons on western blot. Topic 2. Where is IL-18 expressed? IL-18 is primarily expressed by dendritic cells, neutrophils, monocytes, macrophages, and epithelial cells. It is also constitutively expressed within the cytoplasm and nucleus of a variety of hematopoietic cells, non-hematopoietic cells, and keratinocytes. High interleukin-18 protein expression is found in the cerebellum, respiratory system, proximal digestive tract, gastrointestinal tract, female tissues, skin, and lymphoid tissues. Lower levels of protein expressions are found in the liver, gallbladder, kidney, urinary bladder, and male tissues. You can find more information on proteinatlas.org to check out which cell lines express IL-18 and which ones don't. This information will come in handy when designing positive and negative controls for Western blot and immunohistochemistry. Topic 3. IL-18 in Western Blotting Antibody specificity can make or break an experiment. After looking through Western blot images from publications and antibody companies, Researchers can typically expect two bands in an interleukin-18 western blot, the inactive 24 kilodaltons precursor, and the mature biologically active IL-18 and approximately 18 kilodaltons. Topic 4. Some interesting facts about interleukin-18. IL-18 not only acts on the immune system, but also on other systems and physiological processes, such as the endocrine system, the nervous system, and bone metabolism. Studies in animal models have demonstrated the unique, dual effect of IL-18 to both inhibit and promote tumor progression and metastasis. Because of this, since its discovery in 1989, many studies have been designed to investigate the antitumoral activity of IL-18, as well as the possibility and efficacy of using interleukin-18 for therapeutic purposes. Thank you for watching, and check out the links and references in the description box below. Let us know in the comments which biomarker you would like us to discuss next. Subscribe to stay tuned for more biomarker videos.